What's up friends? So we just watched this awesome video of a hamster obstacle course and that inspired us to get a little bit more creative with Lego bricks. So we contacted an expert and she gave us some tips on how to make this awesome Lego hamster habitat. So before we bring out our little furry friend, our expert gave us six tips on creating the best hamster mansion possible. So we wanted to give you a tour of our hamster house. Let's take a look at the exercise room. The playroom. Go down this hallway. Squeak, squeak, squeak. To the jungle gym. To the common room. Up the ramp to his master bedroom. He's got a bed. He's got a little secret bed in here and a little drawer. We've got one more thing to show you and it's pretty awesome. Here's the kitchen. A kitchen. But what we can do with this is we can switch out another room modular style and put this in so then you can switch up the layout of the whole habitat whenever you want. So in case we're gonna be reconstructing, we've made these walls to block off any hallway so our hamster can still enjoy his house while we're under construction. All right, I think it's time we introduce you guys to our newly adopted friend, Blanche, and introduce her to her new house. Ow. So we're talking softly because when animals are in new environments, it's sometimes a little bit scary and we don't want to add like extra complications with noises and stuff. Tip one, have enough bedding. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. To the drawer, to the drawer. Get it to the drawer. Can I, can I move the ramp? I don't want to. Oh, oh, you got like that. That was a good maneuver. Look, look, she's about to open it. She's about to open it. Oh, my heart. What are you getting ready for the day? Oh, yeah, she's, she's got it now. Yeah, she's all up in it. Tip two, have enough room for activities. She's ready to do some chest presses. Just gotta turn over, bud. Oh, she's ready to lift. Get on that wheel. She's like, no, I'm gonna do some cardio instead. Maybe we should not put this on the wheel. <laughs> cardio. Tip three, have enough food and water available. She's such a cute little explorer. Look at her go. I can't even see her, what's she doing? I don't know. I, don't know. I can hear her crunching on some food though. Hang on the kitchen, that's where I spend most of my time. She's eating from the bowl. Oh, no. The bowl fell over. She took down the table. Tip four, build high walls. Okay, it's a really good thing we made those high walls. Yeah. Because it looks like she almost caught out. Yeah. She likes to stretch. I want to see her do some parkour. She's literally a ball of fluff. I love it. Tip five, no small spaces or holes. Oh, she was a clown. Order off those calories. Oh, yeah. That was a good attempt. Tip six, avoid small bricks. Oh, she's playing with her toys. Yes, go down. She's so cute. Does she want to cook in the kitchen? Or does she want to take a nap? down below what kind of house you would make for your furry friend. And if you like this video, click one of these to watch more Briculous. Mm -hmm. And don't forget to subscribe right down there. True.